the calm of the surface of the Ponds Forge pool about to be disturbed by these eight gentlemen. The men's 50 metres butterfly, fastest qualifier for which in lane four is Alex Boyce, a student at Loughborough University, 25.06. There's no Mark Foster, the British record holder. He's done his work for this week and is assured of his place in Sydney. So Alex Boyce has the honour of occupying lane four. Also in this race, Greg Phillips of Portsmouth North Sea in five. And the very experienced David Jones, the Welsh record holder, in lane three. Plus Janko Gojkovic from the Maxwell Club in lane six. So there are plenty of swimmers with plenty of experience at this sort of level. And leading them out is David Jones in lane three. Strong challenge coming in from Greg Phillips in five now. And it's between those two. Alex Boyce putting in a challenge in four. But David Jones is going very strongly for the wall. So too is Phillips. It's all on the touch. And it goes to Phillips in 25.04 seconds. Just 19 one hundredths ahead of David Jones. Yeah, Jones uh, in the picture there. There's Phillips. You'll be pretty pleased with that. National champion. Quite a tough race, you know, 150 metres fly, because you've got to get those arms out and round, and sometimes the temptation is to really over-rev it, to actually go too fast with your arms rather than grabbing the water. And that's the real danger, so it's a real sort of balance between slipping, because you, you tend to slip the water if you go too quickly, so i.e. don't actually hold on to it and push yourself forward. The start is so important in these races, though, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, some of our swimmers are not great on the world stage. I was just talking to Bob Pay, actually, one of the old British coaches that coached myself and Andy Jameson through the Olympics in 88. And um, great start and finish coach. And we spent a lot of time on those. Because you just know that you can get you know, nearly half a second. And if you're going to win or lose a race by a hundredth of a second, then you want to get it where you can. And on a 50, it is critical. And we're just not, I don't think, spending enough time on it. Because we're still missing some of the world's best. Fourth last year. More importantly for him, first this year, Greg Phillips, 